When Mozart died in 1791, he left some of his works incomplete. Among them was a rondo for horn and orchestra in D major. Well, this horn rondo is quite an interesting story because Franz Xaver Süßmeier, a pupil of Mozart, composed a new horn rondo based on some motifs from Mozart's sketch in 1792 and today many people know this Süßmeier version as the rondo to Mozart's first horn concerto, although it's not by Mozart but by Süßmeier, only based on some motifs. Mozart himself sketched the whole movement and he did it quite differently than Süßmeier and it's quite complete, it's only missing the instrumentation. So when I was 18 I thought, well, I should try to complete it so you could listen to it. So now you have the chance to listen to Mozart's last horn concerto in a re reconstructed version by me and I did it the following way. The black notes you will see are original by Mozart, I didn't change them. The red notes are added by me. So you can really see clearly where my part is and where Mozart's part is. The green notes were Mozart's original version, which he changed because the horn player was quite old and could not play some difficult passages. So I thought, well, I used the original intention by Mozart before he changed them to be easier to play. So I hope you like this approximation of how Mozart's last horn rondo may have sounded. Have fun! <laughs>
Thank you.